Hello everyone, this is Danny from creatingawebstore.com and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to crop an image in a circle or actually in a shape I should say because you can use uh, other uh, shapes besides uh, circles. So to start simply open up your image and once the image is open simply look in the layer section to make sure that that image is unlocked. If you do not see the layers uh, window here simply go to window and make sure that layers has a check mark next to it so uh, to unlock the layer simply double click it now once you've unlocked your layer you are ready to uh, create a uh, circle so to do this you will want to uh, find the ellipse tool shape here now um, note that uh, you might not see it in your uh, tools uh, bar here instead you might see another shape so just look for either a uh, rectangle, a rounded rectangle, a polygon, a line tool, or a custom shape tool that looks like this. And just right click and make sure that ellipse tool is uh, selected by left clicking on it. So after you've uh, selected the ellipse tool, you will want to make sure that paths is selected here. Uh, the others are shape layers and fill pixels. So you will want to make sure that paths is selected. It actually looks like a pen with a square in the background. So now we can uh, begin to draw our circle. Simply place uh, the mouse cursor where you'd like the circle to begin and hold down the shift key. Uh, holding down the shift key on your keyboard actually uh, makes uh, the circle uh, perfect. For example, if you were to drag with the mouse alone, it might not be a perfect circle. So then just hold down the left uh, button on your mouse and simply drag to your uh, desired location and then uh, simply release the left mouse button and then release the shift key on your keyboard and then place the cursor over the line here of the circle and then right click uh, with your mouse and uh, left click on make selection and then for feather radius you can just leave it at zero pixels and click OK and then go to select here and left click on inverse and now simply go to edit and left click on clear and now your uh, image has been cropped in the shape of a circle so uh, there are other things you can do for example you can now crop this image I uh, simply selected the crop tool and I just place uh, the crop tool I make a selection on the edges of the circle and then I just left click two times to crop. So now since our background is transparent, if we were to upload uh, this image on our uh, website, uh, whatever uh, color the background of the page on the website is, uh, that would be shown here. That is if you uh, save the image in the right format. For example, if you were to go to File, uh, Save for uh, Web and Devices, left click on this and make sure that the image type is set to PNG-24 PNG-8 and make sure that transparency is selected then you would actually be able to have um, an image with a transparent background uh, saved. Of course you can always color this in yourself by uh, simply going to the layers window here and then clicking on create a new layer and then simply make sure that the empty layer is selected and uh, drag it down so that the image is actually above the empty layer and then simply go to edit again make sure that your empty layer is selected go to edit and left click on fill and then select the color for example I can choose any color here I can um, go with let's say a yellow and then I just click on OK and I click on OK once more and now my background is yellow and you can also even um, create like a border around the circle by uh, simply double clicking on the layer and then going to where it says stroke just left click on stroke here and then where it says position simply move it to inside left click on inside here and you can even adjust the size of the 
border example I'm going to put in one and I can even change the color of the border to let's say uh, a dark orange or actually orange I should say and then left click on OK of course you can also just keep the border and get rid of the background simply going back to your uh, layers window here and selecting the background layer and either clicking the trash can to uh, delete it or click on the eye here to make it invisible and now you would have a uh, image that has been cropped in the shape of a circle with a border around it so thanks for watching stay tuned for more videos and also be sure to check out creatingawebstore.com